Are you impressed with your overalls? Well, we'll see. I'm a bit hot, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tinkerbell! Is this her first time in it? Yeah. Hello, welcome to installment one of our van build. So, so far, we have managed to take out, well, I say we have, Chris has done most of this. He took out all of the seats underneath the seats. This is something we weren't expecting. So if you're planning on converting a mini bus like we have, underneath there was just like this whole big grid network of thick metal bars that they were all attached to. So there was the flooring, then they were bolted into this stuff, which we just didn't get on camera, sorry. <laughs> all right, you want to talk, so, you talk yeah. Okay, go then, go for it. Say what you've done so far. Okay, well, yeah, so I removed the seats, which was not too bad, but quite difficult because some of the bus bolts were rusted right in and we had to snap some of them to get them out, which was quite difficult, wasn't it? Yeah. But then once we took all the seats up, underneath the plywood floor, there was a box steel frame, which I've got no pictures of. Helen kept telling her I'd get them and I didn't. And then I even take it to the dump and I still didn't take pictures of it. <laughs> so I'm quite rubbish at this. I'll try and get better and make sure I get pictures of everything that we do. But that was really heavy. And in the end, I had to get help to get that out because I couldn't hold the bolts at the top and the bottom at the same time. So um, we took it to, to a, a guy that lives near here who's got a ram and um, he, I got in the van and he unbolted them all from underneath and I just held the tops in place. So we've got that out and that's gone to the dump. The van itself is looking pretty good underneath all that. We've just swept it all out. Yeah, hence the red face. Yeah. <laughs> it's hot today. It's it a is hot very day. hot, yeah. <laughs> But it's a, yeah, a little bit rusty, especially by the door where people were obviously coming in and out with wet feet the whole time. Mm. And that's gone right through wherever there was a bolt, rust built up around it. So we're gonna have to, nothing needs welding, but we are gonna have to treat some of it. So the next job is to completely take out the ceiling. Are you doing the walls as well? Yes. And the walls and then completely, then you're gonna treat the, then the plan is to treat all the rust patches properly and then we're going to paint completely through with a with the rust killing hammerite paint just to be on the safe side to make sure that we don't get any rust coming back and in the meantime we're sort of having fun planning the whole layout and starting to think about materials we want to use and that sort of thing which is which is the fun part which yeah. is that i'm enjoying <laughs> you're doing all the tough bits <laughs> And then also we'll be sorting out the sound dampening. So I hope you enjoyed this little update. All right, I did say that these would be short videos, so hopefully this is, <laughs> I think it will be. And I'll see you again next time. If you want to follow this van build journey, please make sure you hit subscribe and the little bell button for notifications. And thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye. You say bye. bye. <laughs> it's quite fun having you in my videos for a change. <laughs>